Hello everyone, my name is Rafael Lorenzo and I'd like to show you today a 3D model that I've been working on. It is a Japanese story. Here you are, Here you can see it. It is uh, designed so it can be 3D printed. And in this uh, small video, I'd like to show you how to adjust the clearance. Uh, in the GitHub uh, project, there is a, um, a folder called STL and inside you have the files already prepared for 3D printing um, with a clearance of 0.5 millimeters. but still, if you need to adjust it, just follow these instructions. Um, first of all, you have to download FreeCAD if you haven't done it already. It is available in the website freecadweb.org and for most of the popular operating systems in the market. You go back to the to the GitHub website and in, uh, in here I've uh, included a command that you can run to uh, clone the repository. So let's go ahead and do it. Okay, here it is. This, this is the file that contains the model and this is a, a small script that will help you to, up, uh, to, to update the clearance. So let's open FreeCAD. Please check that you have at least the version 0 0.15 installed. Okay, uh, I can only tell you that it works with this one. Click on File Open to open the files and open not only the model but also the script. Here you are. And here you can see the model and here you have the hierarchy with three folders. The first folder is the one showing at the moment. When you click on any objects inside the folder they highlight and if you press the space bar the, the, the object just hides and shows again. You can do the same for the whole uh, folder and there you are. In the second folder you have the parts uh, arranged in a way that uh, they can be used for 3D printer, 3D printing. And let's go to see how to adjust the clearance. So I'm gonna zoom in. So you can see here the effect of the clearance. In here and in here and in here, all the all the parts where the the different the objects are joined together have a, a small uh, gap and that gap at the moment is 0 0.5 millimeters and this is the way of, us, of adjusting it. So you move to the script, it is a very small script in Python and you click on the playback uh, icon. It first requests for uh, you to enter the clearance in an in a, uh, interval of 0 0.01 millimeters up to 1 millimeter. So let's try using the smaller interval, the smaller part of the interval, and it is 0 0.01 millimeter. As you can see here, all the parts are very, very tightly uh, joined. So let's try again now with the maximum possible, which is one millimeter. And there you are, it is a massive gap. You probably won't need that much, but here you are. So you can adjust this this way. Um, so once you have done it, all the parts will will get updated automatically. And the only thing that lasts is to open here this folder, uh, parts for printing. Select them all, and by clicking in File Export, you will be able to save it again as a SDL file. And you are done. If you have any comments, please uh, send them and I, I'll do my best to answer them. And thank you for watching. See you soon.